Melissa Ortiz is a professional soccer player who's on the Colombian national team. My name is Melissa Ortiz. I'm a professional soccer player for the Colombian national team. I have played in uh, various big tournaments, including the 2012 London Olympics, uh, 2010 Under 20 World Cup, and hopefully this summer in the 2016 Rio Olympics. Sadly, she went through a tragic injury that resulted in surgery, and she could not attend the Women's World Cup or the Pan American Games. Uh, the moment that I got injured, I knew that I tore my Achilles tendon right there on the field. Um, I was crying, obviously, but when my teammates rushed over, you know, to give me like words of comfort and stuff, I said, don't stop crying, stop crying, and I told them, no, I'm not crying because it hurts, you know, it doesn't, my foot is as numb, I don't feel anything. I said, I'm crying because I know I have to get surgery right away and I, I'll be missing you know, the World Cup and missing Pan American Games. She has appreciated everything the national team has brought to her. Playing with the national team completely changed my life a uh, whole 180 degrees because I never really had that plan in my life. Um, when I was younger, I wanted to play soccer and be a professional soccer player. But I was also leaning towards being, you know, uh, like an architect, going more to a professional career other than sports. Um, but when I was in college and I got recruited to the national team and I got a taste of what it's like to play for Colombia, I knew in that instant I wanted to keep on doing it. So it changed my life because I've had so many great experiences from it, such as traveling the world, you know, I've played in numerous amount of countries all over the world for Colombia and I've got to train with great great soccer players I got to meet some really important people in the soccer world um, and it has given me um, you know more of the strength and the person it made me the person that I am today you know I'm more mentally stronger physically stronger and I feel like you know whatever is in my path in the future I'll be I'll be ready for it because the national team has prepared me in so many ways. She loves and looks forward to inspiring young soccer players. I would advise young soccer players to go for their dreams, uh, never give up, no matter if there's a setback, whether it's an injury, whether it's a coach not really liking you, if you're not really getting playing time on the field. Um, it's just use those things as a drive to make you work harder. Um, I think soccer has evolutionized now to not only being athletic, but very technical. So as many hours as you can get, being uh, doing technical drills with the ball is most important. Melissa Ortiz looks forward to many things in her future soccer career. Short term wise, I look forward to competing in another big tournament. So for instance, we have the Olympics this summer in Rio. Um, other than that, I look forward to uh, what is most important is inspiring others and inspiring other girls to follow their dreams and hopefully to, to be on the Colombia national team um, because we have so much future and there's so much to build in women's soccer. So I think, you know, for me, I would like to keep on playing and making a big impact um, and inspiring other, other people. Melissa Ortiz is a great person, soccer player, and role model to young soccer players in Colombia, the United States, and all around the world. She believes that women's soccer has come a long way since it started, and it still has a long way to go from here. Um, but you know, you never know where life can bring you, and I'm fully prepared for whatever's ahead. <laughs>